Hello my lovely viewers and welcome to something a bit different today. Today we're playing Goddess. You might have heard of this game. It's um, a PC game. I'm playing on uh, my phone though, as per usual. And um, yeah, it's awesome. I, I'm, I'm going to have trouble explaining it, but basically um, it's created by uh, Peter Molinux. Pardon if I've uh, pardon me if I've uh, pronounced that wrong. Uh, he created Fable. One, two, and three. And uh, he's a great, great game designer person thing. <laughs> and basically, anyway, um, it's a world building game in which you have a bit of land and you can sculpt the land in any way you see fit. I'll show you now. Like so. You have different layers that can be moved. And to do that, you use something called belief, which is the uh, pink uh, bubble in the left hand corner at the bottom. And yeah, you've got to just basically uh, grow and expand your community. You start off with just two little followers. I would have done it from the start, but there's uh, I don't I don't think I'm going to be making a series of this. I just thought I'd put place them for uh, for a video. So yeah, so let's collect some belief, and you get powers. That's that. There we go. And yeah, the aims just to expand your land. You get um, different powers as well. Um, so, I don't know what the powers are actually, I haven't used any. Um, yeah, so forests, reign of purity, finger of God, beautify. I don't know what any of these do yet because I haven't unlocked them. And like I just said, you've just got to expand and build. And uh, yeah, it's, it's a nice game, it's calm. <laughs> And uh, it reminds me of a game I used to play when I was younger called Populous, which I believe was made by the same guy. I could be wrong. I think I'm wrong, actually, aren't I? But yes, yeah, it's, it's a lovely, calm game. Makes a change from what I've been playing lately with Five Nights at Freddy's and uh, Turbo Dismount. And I've, I've just started playing Goat Simulator. I'm going to be uploading that soon. So yeah, it's nice. It's a nice welcome change. So uh, we need to expand our population. What cards have we got? You get these cards as well. Um, I'm, I'm having trouble explaining this. Uh, you get these cards which do different things for your world. And you get stickers at the bottom, which I'm you can see here, which I'm moving. Um, and you put the stickers on the cards. And as you can see, I've started this one here that I'm clicking on now. It's the one I'm trying to unlock right now. And I've put a few stickers on it already. And I'm ne I've nearly filled the bar. I just need one more sticker. And there's loads, as you can see, that do different things. And I think, I'm not too sure because I'm quite, like, I'm near the start of the game. I think the world evolves and um, it grows, if that makes sense. It, um, time progresses. I think, I could be completely wrong about that. So this here, this big settlement, is a farm. And basically what I did was um, I got a card that allows me to put all the houses in one area. So say this area here of houses, you can uh, select that and it'll just put them into that one little plop there. So that's useful for, you know, saving room. Let's get this guy uh, building a house there along with you. So yeah, it's a lovely game. I, I really like it. Um, so it's available on Android. I'm not sure about iOS and it's completely free. Um, there is in-app purchases, but so far, um, I'm about three hours in, something like that. I haven't had to buy anything. The only problem I've had is, like with many phone games, I've had to come away from it and let, like, stuff refill. You know, like, for instance, these, these timers here, like, that's going to take 24 minutes to build. Then again, I can get more people on it to uh, to help contribute to the building of that. Yeah, but besides that, it's a, it's a great game. I, I can't complain. It's really good. Let's... Uh, Actually, there is one complaint, so you can rotate the camera, but it's awkward the way you do it. You use, it, you use two fingers and you kind of, you know, I think you, you can kind of gather what I mean. Um, but it doesn't always work for some reason. I'm not quite sure why. It needs to be a bit more sensitive. Uh, right, let's go on a voyage. So as well, to um, earn yourself some stickers, which I really need to do, you can send your people on uh, voyages. And they go to distant lands, and they... But basically, you have to... Um, I'll show you now. You you have to... Uh, it's like a puzzle. You have to lead them from one end of the map to the other. Um, without getting them killed. So, right. So, 
these guys here, they're giants. I can't zoom in yet. There we go. These guys here are giants. Champions, sorry, they're called champions. And if your followers, which are on this boat here, uh, go anywhere near him or them, they will be killed instantly. Um, so you need to kind of um, obscure him, you know, make sure that he's out of the way and that your followers can't go near him. But also ensure that your followers have a clear path to the finish, which is over there. Right, so let's get started. I haven't done this one yet. I've tried, but I keep failing epically at it. So we're going to give this one a go. I think I have an idea. Maybe not. Ooh, how are we going to do this? No, 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 go back, go back, move from that. Thank you. Right, I need belief. Okay. That should be okay. This should, should be all right if... Um... Where are they? They're trying to get up there. So this this one, I, I'm really stuck on. I, tried, I did try this before. This should be a bit better. Oh, they're whistling. I don't know if you can hear that. It's just a lovely game. Oh, why are you going that way? It's a bad idea. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> there we go. That was easy, actually. <laughs> so, yeah, every time you do one of those, you, uh, you get points, and the points contribute to getting stickers. Victory! Two stars. I've, I've never had a three star. Still rewards to be won in the voyage. Try three stars on all missions. I know, I know. Sell onwards. Okay. Uh, isn't this the one I just did? I'm guessing I've done them all, but I haven't got three stars on them. Right. Oh, what was that? Stop being silly! Don't go near him! No! Oh! <laughs> oh, they're dead. Oh well, right, we'll go back to land now. To our little uh, island. Home, please. Have we unlocked any stickers? No, we haven't. So we've done that one. That is the last one. Yeah. Right, home we go. Can you hear that? Build them, complete them. Build them, complete them. You have a farmer. Yep, I know about that. For some reason, though, every time I try and click on the farmer to do some farming. One sec. See if I can rotate the camera. No, it's not rotating. One sec. Okay, take the camera. Doesn't like it though. Right. Anyway, every time I try and click on the farmer to uh, move him to do some farming, doesn't seem to want to. Anywho, onwards. Right, we need more abodes. We need more abodes. Oh, have I just done it? Have I? Oh, cool. Yay, I've done it. I've, I've done my first farm. There we go. That's a start. Right. Now, what I was doing before I started recording this was I was trying to expand. Because, uh, as you can see, it's a bit clumped up. So we could do with... Um, yeah, what's, what's that? We've got a new card. Super fast building. Cool beans. Yay! Right, okay, so we need wheat, which is what this is. Okay. Good. 
As I was saying, we need more um, abodes, um, which is where belief comes in, because belief helps us move this land and create it and all that jazz. Create it? To um, form it and all that jazz. And uh, So I need, what I need to do is get rid of all this here, which will take a lot of belief. You can see my points are whittling down. No, 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 no. There we go. But we will get there. Tree, um, destroying trees and rocks gives you belief as well. Only a tiny amount, like, bear in mind. But it does give you it. Yeah, it's a lovely game, this. It's so pretty, I think. It's got a very unique style to it, art direction. Ah, uh, we're low on belief. Also, scattered throughout this uh, world, there are little chests. You can see one under here. If I'd have been smart, I removed uh, the terrain around this area. I could have got that chest. And that chest will have um, stickers in it. Which would have been really useful. Okay, we've got another card. Right. Hmm. No, we don't want to do that. We can do that. Yeah, let's do that. Right. No, let's leave that now. Okay. Also, um, you've probably noticed throughout the game that I've had at the top of there. Check on the Astari people. They're, um, this race. There they are. don't know if you can see them. They're this... Uh, race that'll uh, annoy your followers and um, they'll put the mood of your followers, anyone that's in the area of them, it'll go down so they'll do things a lot slower or not at all sometimes oh there's lots of, where's this? oh wow okay I didn't, I didn't see this right we how do you collect it then? Ah, okay. I, I have no idea what this is, but cool. Cool. Right. No, we can't move him to do that. But what we can do is tell them to build. They should automatically go there and build because it's not too far away. What can we do in the meantime, eh? More belief to collect. Let's take down some of these trees over here so we can get a bit of belief. So yeah, if you haven't, if if you're into uh, populous black and white, all that jazz, then definitely give this game a try because it's it's a it really is a good game. I've been playing it the last few days. Whenever I've got a bit of time, I, I really do love it. And it's made in the UK, if I, if I remember rightly. Guildford, I think. I could be wrong. So, yeah, that's that's always nice to see. A UK-based game. <laughs> and I believe the studio is called 22 Cans. So definitely, definitely give it a try if you get the uh, chance and you're into this sort of thing. Because it is awesome. Rather relaxing and soothing. <laughs> Right, can we collect? We, right, we can't collect that. Okay, cool. So yeah, as um, also another thing that I forgot to mention is this thing over... Where is it? Where are you? Right, so this thing over here is a shrine, I think. That's a shrine. Mm, it's a temple. Uh, where is it? One sec. Where is it? This thing over here is a shrine, and uh, every time you light one up, uh, it expands the area. So all this, not all of it, but most of it will go uh, into colour. And then you can build on it. Do, 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 
do What was that noise then? Hmm. That noise was rather odd. Okay. Let's uh, just try and get some relief so we can continue building. Farming away. Let's check on our houses. No, no belief. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We haven't got enough belief to do anything, really. I keep hearing these very odd noises, and I keep wondering what they are. Right, there's something under there. It's a chest. Don't know if we can get to that, though. I don't think we can. I'm gonna try. No. That was worth a try. Uh, as well, there are weather conditions, or if you want to call them that. There are um, different weathers in it. It does rain. That's the only one I've seen so far. <laughs> but yeah, there, there, there is uh, rain in this game. And the houses, you've probably seen that at the beginning actually, the houses sway from side to side. And they look like they're going to be blown over at any minute. I hope they don't get blown over. I mean, I hope they can't, I should say. Do, 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 do. And this here, this little ugly plot of land here, that's uh, mud. Mud slows down your followers. And I'm guessing, I haven't checked really, I shouldn't have built on here, but I'm guessing it gives them a uh, negative boost, rather than a positive boost to their uh, attitude and all that jazz. I wonder if we, can, if we can expand this over, yeah we probably can. Try and link this up. You might want to move, sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Aww. Let's check on you, right. Boost high. You're a breeder. Okay, um, let's link this up. Like that. That'll do. And I shall work on this when I have a bit more uh, time and uh, belief. Anyway, I'll leave this video here. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to uh, leave a like and subscribe. And I shall see you guys in the next video. Bye.